Everything is closing. What's going on everyone, Dev the Michiganer here coming at you with another video. Now today's going to be a short little video talking video where I ramble on about certain things. Like today, um, we went out and about, I had videos planned, um, I'm planning on doing advent more adventure videos um, as I do my daily vlogs as well, but the places we had planned were closed. Like everything seems closed, like today we went to this like indoor flea market that has like a whole bunch of cool booths that i wanted to go check out maybe possibly hunt for disney memorabilia hunt for uh horror memorabilia and just go and see if i can find any collectibles but when we got there more than half of the places were closed there was like barely anything there there was a couple t-shirt making places and then there was um, a couple jewelry places there was the donut shop I'm on a diet so I can't have donuts and then there was a couple um, like young like essential living type things oils and everything like that there but I wasn't interested in that stuff. They had one place that had um, a lot of collectibles, and it was mainly like uh, model cars. And I don't collect model cars. I know people who do, but I don't collect them. So I don't understand why all these places are going. Like, this pandemic is ruining, like, daily life and weekend life. Just everything. This pandemic is ruining it. But tomorrow, tomorrow mon tomorrow's Monday, today's Sunday, um, tomorrow I was planning on going to the Henry Ford Museum. That backfired. I should have got um, a reservation sooner because I forgot it was Martin Luther King Day on Monday. And guess what? Henry Ford Museum was free on Martin Luther King Day. And wow, like they were sold out. Like I tried getting them tonight. And they were just gone. That would have been a really cool video to do. But they were just gone. Like, I can't... Like, everybody just wanted to go to the Martin... Uh, everybody just wanted to go to the Henry Ford Museum. Like, jeez. Like, man. Well, that's probably a good thing in a sense. Because there will probably, probably be a lot of people there. Even though the Henry Ford Museum is huge. Um, but I do plan on going there uh, soon. Soon. That's an indoor thing. It's not going to be cold so soon. And in the spring, I plan on going to their Greenfield Village, which is a historic town. Love it. I probably I talked about it in a couple other videos. That place is a must. But tomorrow, I don't know what I'm going to do. Um, maybe just take a random trip to Frankenmuth. I know I do a lot of Frankenmuth videos, but I love Frankenmuth, so why not? So. But I might figure something else out. But in the meantime, while I'm trying to find uh, adventure videos and make some cool videos for you guys, I st still will be doing the daily videos. Um, adventure videos will come up at certain times. Like, they'll replace a daily video if I get them up in time. And uh, you'll just see a lot more daily videos for me. I'm still going hard on that weight loss journey. And I decided to take up a new hobby uh, to help me keep my mind preoccupied so food doesn't get in the way. I decided to take up painting. I bought this little kit. I'm going to try out painting because I was watching some YouTube videos on the Epcot um, art, art, their, their art festival going on at the Epcot. I watched a lot of YouTube videos on that. I love watching the people that go to Disney. But I started seeing like all these paintings of like Mickey Mouse and Disney and stuff like that. I was like, I could do something like that. Maybe with horror. Maybe with Disney. Maybe with Michigan art. I, I painted before. See? That's one of my paintings right there. That was like a quick one I did. I just put some colors on. Painted some trees. Put a little lighthouse. Made like a beach type thing. So I've painted before. So it can't be that hard, right? This was a deal. Just I was at there. It was 10 bucks for this thing. It's crazy. It comes with brushes, pencils, it has three canvases, a bunch of different colored paints. I can't wait to crack this open and see what I can do. So I have something to do if we ever, if we do go in lockdown. I have a, 
new hobby that I'm going to be going for. Um, I'm still going to do YouTube. I love doing YouTube. Um, ever since I started YouTube, I've gained more, more love for making videos. I used to be scared to be in front of the camera. If you go back to my very first video, I was kind of awkward in front of the camera. But as you watch it, I get more and more comfortable. And it's just like talking to my best friend. So, um, yeah, and you guys are my best friends so I hope you guys stay connected so yeah I just wanted to come on here and um, talk about how I'm a little upset that a lot of things are closing or are closed I'm hoping that a lot of things will start to open back up soon and into the spring because I know there's some things that I wanted to do that are closed because of winter but there's also a lot of things closed because of the pandemic and I know we don't like talking about it but it's still here I just hope it stops soon and we can get back on to our wonderful lives. So with that being said, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this. It was just a little talking video, me rambling on, explaining that there's nothing really open around me and I'm getting a little frustrated with it, but I will find stuff to do and film it for you guys. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. Helps me out, makes me feel good. Helps get my videos out to more people so they can enjoy them. And if you are new here, remember to subscribe and hit that bell icon so you never miss a video because I do post daily. And if you hit that bell icon, you'll never miss a video. And with that being said, guys, I hope you guys have a great day. And remember, get your foot out the door because adventure awaits. I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.